Welcome to The Watches TV. Audemars Piguet has just launched a very, very interesting new chronograph, which is the Royal Oak Concept Michael Schumacher Lap Timer Chronograph. This chronograph is special because it allows to measure lap time with two different second hands. In fact, it's a really, really complex machine. So let's go and discover with François Benamias, CEO of the brand, what it is. It's called the Michael Schumacher Chronograph Lap Timer. It's a mechanism that was, uh, it's an idea that actually came from Michael's brain uh, in 2010 on our very first meeting at Audemars Piguet when he, he, he was uh, at the factory to potentially become an ambassador. And he said, I know that you're going to make a special edition with me and we could make a watch together and that's fine, but I've heard that you are supposedly the best watchmakers in, in the world. So I've got a challenge for you. Could you make me a mechanism that would measure laps? And we looked at each other and said, potentially, <laughs> we have to look at that and we'll come back to you. Because there was no way we would have given an answer just like that. And three, four months later, we came back to him and said, we know we can do it. We don't know how much time it's going to take, but we know we can do it. So it took us three good years to finish everything, but then it's one thing to say it's done, it's another one to then test everything because Michael would never have allowed us to have a watch that wouldn't work perfectly. So the technology was done, the movement was put together, the casing was also put together. Now we had to run some serious tests and it did add an extra 14 months because this is where we are now, 14 months after the end of 2013 where we can finally release the watch. When you start a, a mechanism from scratch, from absolute scratch, and it's ready in three years, that's an achievement. But then you have to run the test. You don't know what you could find because there are so many components that could go wrong, so many little functions that couldn't go the right way. So to be able to do the whole thing in one full package in less than five years, that's pretty serious. And that actually is going to open the future chronograph movement for the Marpiguet, but I'm not talking about a chronograph at that level. It's a chronograph that we have been working on now for two and a half years, and uh, it's going to be the very first integrated mechanism chronograph that will go in the current collection in, within the next two years. It's Michael Schumacher's idea to make that lap timing mechanism. So when you got the accident, we let the family alone for quite some time, obviously. Uh, but at one point, we had to ask the question, what do you want us to do? Because we are pretty much open to anything you, you guys want to do. We sat down together, and on the very first hour, the conclusion was, no, no, you don't stop anything. You keep making that mechanism, and you're going to keep making that mechanism associated with our name. We say, you sure? Because people will question that potentially. Say, no, no. Michael was so thrilled in October 2013 when he came to the factory and he saw the watch for the first time in real. He put it on the wrist, he saw the dial, he saw the ergonomy of the case, he saw everything, he said, perfect. And Sabine, his agent, told us that on the way back to his office, he was like a child who had met, would have met Santa Claus. So they came to us and they confirmed several times, say, guys, it's okay. We will make the watch together. We're going to go to the end of the project. And to show you even more that we're committed to it, let's do this in our house. Not the actual house, because we wouldn't be able to host enough people, but we're going to do this at the ranch. So tonight the event is at Corina's Schumacher's ranch.